Welcome to my garage. Today we're going to make a float bench and try to measure the jets for a Rotax engine. What you need is, of course, fuel. You need a plastic bottle, a piece of fuel lines, pen and paper, a stopwatch, scale, and of course, you need the jets itself. One part I'm going to use is two standard bleeding nipples for the brakes that you can find in any auto store. It's with a 6mm thread. As you can see, I have cut off the end of the bleeding nipples. I have also drilled a hole in the cork on the bottle and one, one hole on the side. So, I have now fixed a hose to the bottle and uh, to the cork and I have put the jet in the end of the hose. Now you fill up the, the bottle with fuel. The amount is not uh, critical because you weigh the, the bottle with the fuel before. We have now 390 grams that you know. And then you just take the bottle and you're ready with your stopwatch and then you time how long it takes for the fuel to uh, run through the jet It is flowing quite nicely. And this hose here is of course for the air to get into the bottle. So it's almost finished. And we got 3 minutes 6 seconds point 68. And now we measure again. And the remaining is 78 grams. 
that give you gives you the amount of fuel that went through and then it's just a calculation then you repeat this a couple of times I have shortened the hose a little bit here and then you restart again Now we are almost finished with the second run. Now we got 3 minutes 5 seconds 0 0.61.